as you know, one of my absolute favorite types of videos to record right now are the unboxings and you guys love them too. So I always love recording them and this one is super exciting guys. We have got the Look Fantastic May Beauty Box and I've got it a little bit early just so I could give you guys an exclusive into what is inside and trust me, it's an absolute flipping corker. You're gonna love it. So let's take a look at the box. It's got a lovely like botanical, like greeny blue. Um, it's like a sage green I'd say and then it's got the trim. I just, I really like them when they're pretty like this and I do think that the Look Fantastic Beauty Boxes nail the packaging every time. Um, I definitely think they're one of the prettiest to unbox. And as we all know, when you unbox your Look Fantastic Beauty Box, you also get kind of the monthly little magazine that comes with it which again I think makes it kind of have a little bit more of a thumbs up than some of the other brands because a lot of them you just get a pamphlet about the products this one you actually get content to read so you can have a cup of tea in the garden or like in the bath whatever you do um, you can just have a little read and if you like beauty there's always lots of like interesting things that you can find in there so I love that we've got that and it's got the same kind of coloring to keep in keeping with our theme I really like it but without further ado guys I know you all want to see what's inside let's dive in to the unboxing Okay, so this is what it looks like on the inside and I'm very excited by some of the brands. I'm trying not to like look too hard so I can go through them with you guys. But the first thing that I noticed in here was a Magnetone Wipeout Cloth. This is one of their eco-friendly microfiber cloths. I have several of these and absolutely love them. Now, technically guys, these are makeup removers that will take off your makeup with just water so you don't need any products. I still use micellar water with these just to kind of ease off things like um, lash glue and mascara, all like the tricky stuff. Um, but yeah, this is is an eco-friendly one which I really really like but if you don't want to use any product with it it will just literally take off your makeup on its own and it's so soft they're so soft and snuggly like I absolutely love these um these are actually really good value anyway you can get multi-packs and things which always makes them more affordable but I like the fact that there's one in here so you can try it and see if it's the sort of thing that you would want to buy a multi-pack of um didn't actually know that um Magnetone the wipeout cloth came in an eco-friendly version that's quite cool so really really pleased with that one okay I'm not gonna lie this excites me a lot guys. We have got one of the Avant products in here. Now Avant are Avant, Avant, I'm not quite sure how you say it, but they are like premium skincare. And I'm not talking like upper price. I'm talking like this moisturizer being a hundred pounds. This is 100 pounds. It's in your beauty box. You can get this whole box for eight pounds. It's an absolute no brainer. This is the Hyaluronic and Sweet Almond Seawater Shea Butter Age Defy Moisturizer. Well, technically it says it's the ultimate hyaluronic acid resurfacing duo moisturizer, but it is full size. It's a 50 mil and it's worth 100 pounds, guys. If you bought this, you'd pay 100 pounds for this actual tube. How crazy is that? Now, because it's got hyaluronic acid in there and it's part of the Age Defy range, it's great for plumping skin, um, giving a brighter, more youthful youthful radiant appearance which should effectively make you look younger but if you're young already then it should just plump the skin and add a little bit more brightness to it but if you're over kind of the 40 bracket maybe 35 noticing fine lines this is the sort of moisturizer you'd want to go for because it's just going to fill in any like little no nooks and crannies that you're noticing to start up here but I can't wait to put this on my face. Anything that is worth that sort of value, I think, man, there's got to be some amazing skincare qualities that come out of that. So I can't wait to try this. £100. Flipping blown away. Guys, I'm not really sure how I follow that, but next up we have got the cause. This is the Hydra Biome. This is a probiotic super dose face mask, which sounds really nice. And then I saw it says it's got real Greek yogurt in it. How's that look? Quite cool. Never ever tried a face mask with real Greek yogurt, but I mean, I'll give it a go. It says it's made in Greece, so that's obviously why, but it says it's a cooling and refreshing face mask. Now, if you're anything like me when you face mask, and I'm doing a lot of face masks at the minute while we're in lockdown, guys, I'm doing at least one a day, at least. It's crazy, but I love it. Um, but yeah, I like a really cooling sensation, especially if I'm having like a hot bath and a pamper. I like a really, really cool face mask, and sometimes I'll just put my normal ones in the fridge for five or ten minutes before I put them on, which works. Uh, but this one says it's got a cool sensation when applied to the skin so I'm very eager to try it I'm just gonna take the lid off it doesn't actually smell of anything um and it's got a really nice texture actually it feels more like a oh actually I can smell it now um it feels a little bit more like a moisturizer it doesn't feel like a thick mask which I think would be really good if you have sensitive skin it does say it's good for sensitive skin but it's a 20 mil so you can try it you'd get a good couple of face masks out of that before deciding if you want to buy the full size or not so yep can't be a good face mask right now you know I think these products are actually really usable everybody needs a good makeup remover everybody needs a good um, moisturizer right now we've all got dry skin we're all indoors a lot more 
and I think everyone's pampering. So I like I like the thinking behind the picks these month this these month this month. Okay, now next up we've got some of the Ico brow gel. Now this is a four mil, so it's the travel size. I'm assuming it's a clear gel. Um, oh no. Actually, it's a darker, like it's a cool tone, dark one, which means I'll actually be able to use it. How cool is that? Um, love a good brow gel. All the ones I usually get in my subscription boxes are clear because I guess that they're trying to play it safe with colours. But that is very much the kind of colour of my actual brows. So I'd 100% be able to use that. I don't think I've actually tried the Ico brow gel before, have I? I've tried all of their mascaras. You guys know I absolutely rave about them. Um, they're fantastic. Um, not tried this one. I think I might have tried a clear one from them. But yeah, really like that. One of those products I'd happily try, see how I got on with it. So do quite like that. And it's a good size, um, you know, four mil. I I find with products that come out on a wand, a four mil will get you quite a lot of uses, so that's pretty cool. Okay, next up we've got some of the Dr. Lip. This is the tint. It says it's sweet potato pigment, guys. Now, I'm guessing it's like a lip balm, but I'm a big fan of Dr. Lip in the sense of, let's be honest, their original product was a nipple balm that was actually able to be used for many, many things. So obviously you could use it on your nipples if you needed to, guys, but it was also great for like dry skin, so elbows, wrists, knuckles, you could use it on your lips as a lip balm, on your brows as a brow gel, there were so many things that you could use it for, it kind of got cult status for that. I've not actually tried one of the tinted versions before, um, but I do like the fact it's a sweet potato pigment, obviously keeping in thinking, thinking? <laughs> keeping in keeping in theme, I need a coffee, keeping in theme with our botanical box, that obviously fits right in, it's very very cute, it's a little four mil size, it's got that really nice little pink tin, it looked great on our lips, a lot of us are going for like more minimal makeup, obviously not me today, um, but yeah more minimal makeup, so something like this, you can keep it in your handbag after lockdown when we're actually allowed to leave our houses, but yeah I really like that, again a really versatile product I like the fact that everything in here can be used by most people so I do like boxes that are quite um they're not like not is it exclusive or inclusive they're not inclusive they they work for everyone that's the word I'm looking for. Okay, and last but not least, I'm very excited by this one. This is the new Balance Me Hyaluronic Plumping Mist, and it's 99% 9.9% 9 .9 natural, which is really cool. Everything in this box is about gentle, natural beauty, toxin-free, all of that kind of stuff, which I love. And this sounds perfect. Now, a good mist like this, it's got hyaluronic um, plumping action in there, which means it's gonna act like skincare, but also work with your makeup. So. This is the sort of product that you could use um, as a primer before your makeup or in the morning. Um, it's gonna just like freshen up the skin. It's obviously got those skincare qualities in there to like plump, but then you could use it throughout the day if you wanted to like pick up your makeup or your skin was feeling a bit dehydrated and it need like it needed just like a refresher, like mid-afternoon when it's starting to come off, but you don't have time to replace your makeup. This is the sort of thing I always use as like my go-to to like give me an instant pick-me-up if I'm in meetings and stuff um, and out and about. I just spritz this all over my face. It just makes my complexion look a bit better. My makeup look not like it's at the end of its lifespan and give it a little bit longer. So it's one of those great products, but you can use it on bare skin. It just refreshes. It's just spritzing anything on your face feels really refreshing, right? So it's one of those things you can use it with makeup without any time of day really really great and it's a really lovely handbag size it's a 10 mil so it's like the travel size really like products like this so i'm actually really pleased with this month's edit i really like the products so guys there we have it that is the may edit of the look fantastic beauty box what do you think as always let me know your thoughts in the comments below as we're going through the video together because i love hearing what you guys think but i've got to be honest this could be one of my favorite boxes this year and i think i said that about one a few months ago but actually this has topped it because 142 pound overvalue i mean that's just that blows my mind um in a box that you can pay eight pounds for it's crazy good um but i actually really like every single one of the products and sometimes when i open these boxes with you guys i'm honest and i'll be like well i can't use that it's not right for me everything in this box i'm going to use and i love that everything is focused on like plant-based beauty green beauty eco-friendly products that sort of range of products that you would find on like those specialist shelves in the shops they've kind of all got a bit more motivation behind them to be green friendly so although they're all different in the qualities that they offer I really like the fact that there's a theme like that running behind it because I am trying to be um, a little bit more careful with the products that I'm using but the standout product for me has got to be this 100 pound moisturizer which I can't wait to actually like love it on my face um where else would you find a 100 pound moisturizer that is pretty cool i love the magnetone wipes i use them already and i'm a big fan of a decent brow gel 
and a tinted lip balm that we can all use like and the face mask was quite all right too so absolutely no faults with this box it's getting a full 10 out of 10 from me which i don't think i've ever given this year so see you soon bye